All right, so today we're gonna fly up some monster sail cats for some catfish too. I fly these guys like any other fish. Pretty easy to fly. Not too bad. I bled them out at the beach. It's kind of important. These guys bleed like a geez, like a stuck hog, man. They're pretty bloody fellers. There we go. Gotta watch because they do have some massive barbs, you know, here. And you can see this one pretty well right here. They will definitely jack you up. Get around this crazy bone structure for that top sail, that top fin. I think you guys are going to be somewhat surprised at how. Decent this meat looks though. It is pretty daggum tasty. It's just a pain in the butt to catch these things, man. And yesterday we got three monsters. I don't typically keep sail cats because I don't know, they're more of a nuisance than anything. But when you get three monsters like this and you haven't had catfish in a long time, I figured we'd do a little catfish too, man. Look at that. I mean, nice. No, I bled them, obviously. But... All right, removing the skin. You don't want to do, you know, you want to leave a little meat on there because you got this red uh, um, I guess mud line, blood vein. See all that stuff in there. So leave a little meat on the uh, skin side when you go to remove the skin. Get all this red stuff off. It just makes the fish taste so much better. There you go, man. Beauties. And I'll probably um, go in there and remove that, uh, the rest of that bloodline as well. In fact, let's do that now. We'll just do it right now, man. Boom.
There we go. Awesome. Put them in the bag. doesn't want me to um, film right now. Okay, you want to say hi to everybody? Let's say hi to everybody. Come on. Say hi. Here. Say hello to everybody. Uh, okay. Let's not, let's not yell at people. Okay. It's not in a good mood. He knows I have food and he, does, he, he wants some. Yeah. 
Tastes like catfish too. Very good.